Hello, change number one is that Slurpee Swamp is now floating. The structures look weird in replay mode, I'm not sure why, but essentially most of the buildings in this area are now raised up, there are boosters in the air, and you can also find jump pads around the area. Oh, and the alien ship is right above it. Change number two is that alien artifacts are now marked on your minimap if you get close to them. That way you can know exactly where they are and which ones you've missed. Change number three is that Bush Ranger is slowly coming out of the grave. If you go over to where he's at, you can find a grave, a shovel, and his body slowly coming out like a tree. Keep in mind that you still can't talk to him and you can break him as well. And if you want to know where this area is at, it's west of Risky Reels. Change number four is that the Gravitron weapon is now in game and you can find it as floor loot, chest loot, and you can also use alien nanites to upgrade your weapon towards a Gravitron weapon. The weapon can grab onto objects and throw them as much as you like. Change number five is a new innocent billboard found at Dirty Docks. Change number 6 is a new style for Rebirth Harley Quinn, so if you have this skin, you'll obtain the style immediately as you go in. Change number 7 is a new double cross skin style, and just like the Harley Quinn style, you'll get this immediately when you go in. As for the final change, change number 8 is a new style for the Party Trooper skin and again, you'll get it whenever you get into the game and it'll be offered to you as soon as you go in.